This is the Stolquist Edge PFD, one of our most versatile life jackets. This economical side zip PFD is ideal for whitewater kayaking, stand up paddleboarding, sailing, and excellent for canoeing and kayak touring. The Edge has a minimalist low profile design with wide arm holes to give paddlers and sailors maximum mobility without getting in the way or chafing. The ergonomically articulated Rapture pre-curved foam hugs the body and graded sizing ensures a personalized fit, especially for very small and very large people. The nice thing about side entry PFDs is that they have a single piece of foam in the front that conforms to your torso, whereas a front entry PFD has two pieces of foam that hinge at the zipper. The edge has seven points of adjustment, two on each side, two shoulder adjustments, and a waist buckle. The shoulder straps are padded and won't chafe your skin when you're only wearing a swimsuit and the sides are mesh for maximum ventilation. We put one large top-loading front pocket on the edge for secure storage and easy accessibility with drainage so that it doesn't fill with water. Like all Stolquist PFDs, we placed high visibility 3M reflective accents on the front and back so you'll be seen on the water. The outer fabric is made of ripstop nylon for durability. I'm Gene Jensen and I travel the country creating videos in order to be able to teach the world to fish. The newly redesigned NRS Chinook is one of the most comfortable PFDs I've ever worn. With the plush padding and the contours of the vest, it makes it very comfortable and very easy to wear all day long. One of the things I love about the NRS Chinook are the pockets. Places to put everything that you need to get to quickly while you're on the water. With a high mesh back and all the adjustments, the Chinook is very comfortable, even in the hottest of days. The NRS Chinook, with its safety and design, allows me to fish without worry and comfortably throughout the entire day. Hi, I'm Mark. This is the Astral V8 Fisher, a low profile, highly breathable PFD that anglers will simply love. Kayak fishing can get hot, very hot, when I'm on the water. With our patented air escape technology, Anglers now have an option to be cool while staying safe. This vest is designed for the serious angler that appreciates the minimalism and high performance of a comfortable PFD. Revolutionary Air Escape airflow system eliminates excessive heat and maintains a comfortable core temperature. It's a great fit for those high back kayak fishing seats. Large pocket for phone and essential items. External folding knife pocket, clipping points for line nips and retractors, high mesh back, plier holsters, white light lashing point on back. The V8 Fisher, for any angler or paddler who wants breathability and simplicity. Choosing the proper size life jacket is one of the most important decisions that you can make on the water. Not only does it provide the necessary safety, but it maximizes your overall comfort. Let's help you find the perfect fitting life jacket. <laughs> A properly fitting life jacket should be comfortable and secure. So what should you look for to find that perfect fit? For kids, life jacket sizing is relatively simple because the sizes are based primarily on weight ranges. If you know the child's weight, then you can reference the youth life jacket size chart to see which size is recommended. For adults, sizing tends to be a little more complicated. Life jackets are not sized the same way as your favorite t-shirt, but there is a great starting point to finding the right fit, knowing your chest size. This measurement is the basis for how most adult life jackets are sized. Using a soft tape measure, wrap the tape around your torso and take the measurement at the fullest part of your chest. Based on that number, reference the adult life jacket size chart and see which size is recommended for you. Now that you've got a recommended size to start with, let's go over the appropriate fit for both neoprene and nylon life jackets. For a neoprene style life jacket, as you put it on, you should have to stretch the life jacket a little bit for the zipper to connect. As you zip it up, the life jacket will pull nice and snug into your chest. From there, connect the buckles and adjust the belts so they feel snug as well. To make sure you've got the right size, raise your arms up over your head and have someone else lift the life jacket from your shoulders. If no one is there to help, you can do it yourself. If it stays securely in place, you should be good to go. If it raises up to your ears or chin, try a smaller size. Another thing to know is that life jackets come in a lot of different styles and they all fit a little differently. So it's possible that you could have the right size and just not the right fit. Now that we've covered neoprene, let's talk about nylon. This material isn't really designed to stretch like neoprene. So when you put them on, the front panels should come close together. The buckles should be easy to secure and the belt should be pulled tight for a snug fit. 
If there's a large gap between the front panels and the belts barely connect, then the life jacket is too small and you should try a larger size. If the front panels overlap when the belts are pulled tight, then the life jacket is too big and you should try a smaller size. Before participating in any water sports or activities where you may need a life jacket, be sure to test the life jacket in the water first. A properly fitting life jacket should remain securely in place and provide the wearer with adequate buoyancy to keep their head above water. A life jacket that's too big will move around in the water and often ride up to your chin or ears, making it very difficult to float comfortably. One that's too small may not close entirely or have the proper buoyancy to float you. For adults with younger children, reference the pamphlet that comes attached to the child's life jacket and teach them how to float comfortably in the water with their life jacket on. Taking these measures is extremely important since young children tend to frantically move around when they unexpectedly end up in the water. These movements can actually hinder the effectiveness of the life jacket, which may cause the child to panic and create an unpleasant experience. Remember that floating calmly and comfortably is a learned skill and is necessary to keep everyone happy and enhance safety on the water.